You know, I'm gonna come out and fucking say it, dude. I'm gonna come out and I'm gonna fucking say it. I'm tired of y'all motherfuckers demonizing me. Demonizing me for your own fucking narrative. I'm tired of it. I'm not a bad guy, motherfuckers. I'm really not. You know what's sad? None of you motherfucking trolls want to get to know me as a person. You know what's funny? Y'all think that you know me, but you don't know me, but I know every troll in the community. I know every single troll, and I know what you guys have done. I know your guys' little fucking thing that you're doing, and it's not okay. I'm sorry if I sound sick. But it's because I am from stress. I've been stressed for the last fucking week. You know, all you guys since 2017 have demonized me. Every one of you has made me out to be a demon, a bad guy, something that I'm not. Like I said, I understand that me falling for what I fell for with Marty, I get that I shouldn't have fell for that. But he needs to be held accountable too. Because he knew what was going on and he could have stepped in and stopped it, but didn't. Which makes him responsible, not me. But you know what's funny? Y'all don't demonize him. You guys worship him like a god. You don't demonize Tony. You guys worship him like a god. Even though he's really a pedophile. And done real in life real shit. To kids. You guys don't demonize real pedophiles. Because half you motherfuckers are pedophile supporters. I'm tired of being demonized by you motherfuckers. I'm tired of being made out to be something that I'm not, goddammit. I'm not a bad guy. I'm not a pedophile. I'm not an, I'm not an evil person. I'm a good dude that got caught up in a fucked up situation. And ever since then, I've been demonized for it. I understand that I fucked up. I get that. But that doesn't mean I need to be held back to my fucking shit for the rest of my fucking life, dude. That doesn't mean I deserve to be held to my crimes forever. What you guys do is fucking disgusting. Every one of you is a fucking sick freak of nature. Every one of you is a fucking little faggot ass bitch. That deserves to rot in the fucking deepest depths of fucking hell. Every one of you deserves to rot behind bars. Every single troll. Every one of you. You know... Before June of 2017, I had a normal life. Working on music, gaming, living my life, hanging out with my friends. And then Marty came in and ripped it all away. Completely ruined my life. Completely fucking destroyed me. Made me look like fucking shit. You know, you guys think you know fucking pain. You think you know suffering, but you don't know nothing about suffering and pain. None of you know what it's like to suffer. 
in silence, not knowing what to do. Akron PD turning their backs on you. Friends walking out because you guys attacked them. Me having to cut off one of my older sisters because she decided to associate with you guys. I've lost more than you guys could ever fucking imagine. You don't understand how many times I have bawled myself to sleep at night crying, wishing all this would stop. Wishing I could get my life back. You don't know how many fucking times I have thought about ending it all and putting myself in the grave. You don't know how many times I've sat here Wishing I had a way out. Wishing I could be myself again. Wanting to be myself so fucking goddamn bad. You guys made me into somebody that I never wanted to fucking be. Ever. You guys ripped my life away from me. All for your fucking goddamn narrative. All so you can get views and clicks. I lost friends, family, jobs. Opportunities that I wanted to take. Sponsorships that I was proud to potentially have. But more importantly, you guys took away my life. You guys took away everything from me. All because I look different. All because I look different. That's why you guys fucking did it. You guys sit there and say all the lies you want, but at the end of the day, that narrative is because I look different. I deserve to have my life ripped away, right? Because I don't look like you guys. I don't dress like you guys. I'm only 5'3", and I live at home with my family to help take care of my family. To help out with bills, to help out around the house because they can't really do that much. I have nothing else. And I'm not going to sit here and allow my family to live without me. Which is why I'm going to be putting in a petition to do something about all this. Because you guys are sick. You are fucked up in the head. I just don't understand how you guys can sit there and sleep at night. Knowing that you fucked up somebody's life. Knowing that you hurt somebody so bad. That it's going to take a long time for them to restore their reputation. I just don't understand how you can sit there and do it and, and live with yourselves and be okay with it. Just because I look different, that doesn't give me the fucking right to push me around. So what? I'm 33. I live at home with my family. No one fucking cares in the real world. No one fucking cares whether I'm 5'3 or I look different.
or that I live with my family. Matter of fact, I have a lot of people applauding me because not many people would stay at home at my age and help take care of their family. I'm tired of it. I don't deserve this. My family don't deserve the threats, the violence, the heinous acts you guys do against us. None of us deserve this. All I want to do is get my life back that every single one of you guys have stolen from me. I know what I'm capable of. I know what I'm worth. I know what I can do. You know, you guys sit there and you talk all this shit, but you know nothing about me. You talk about how my life's all over YouTube and the internet. Which may be true, but you still don't know me as a human being, as a person. And I just want to know why. Why do you guys hate me because I look different? Why does me being different mean you get to bully me? Why do I have to be the one that you guys victimize? Why did Daniel Larson be victimized by you sick freaks? Why did Christian get bullied by you fucking weirdos? You know, just because I look different, that doesn't give me the right to attack. It does not give me that right to, to do what you guys do. Which is why I'm saying this firsthand right here now. Until this shit is put to a stop. I'm deactivating my Twitter. Because I want to help my family. I want to fix my reputation. I want to do better for myself. I'm tired of my health being shitty. I'm tired of being scared all the time. I'm tired of crying tears until I can't cry no more. I'm tired of it. So much was ripped away from me because of you fucking sickos. So much was ripped away from me because of you guys. I gotta go. I can't do this anymore.